Welcome to the Biography Shorts. Here we will be covering the short biography of the one and only Albert Einstein. We will be covering several different topics, so let's begin with the introduction. We'll dive right in. Albert Einstein was a German mathematician and physicist. Perhaps he is most known for his formula E equals MC squared. He is responsible for developing the theory of relativity. Einstein is also a winner of the prestigious Nobel Prize. He won that prize for his work in theoretical physics and the photoelectric effect. Albert Einstein was actually forced to flee Nazi Germany to the United States. He is probably the most famous scientist of all time. Next, we'll explore his early life. Einstein was born on March 14, 1879 in Germany. He was born in the town of Ulm, but he was raised in the city of Munich. Albert Einstein was raised in a Jewish household. Interestingly, Albert Einstein actually attended a Catholic elementary school while observing the Jewish faith. Albert had one older sister, which was his best friend. Albert's father was a successful engineer, while his mom was a stay-at-home housewife. Also, growing up, Einstein had problems with speech. The term Einstein syndrome describes exceptionally bright children who have a speech delay. The next topic for Albert is his education. As a young child, he always felt out of place, especially in elementary school. Einstein actually hated formal education and mostly taught himself. As a young child, he enjoyed and showed a preference for classical music. He would play the piano between studying. Einstein did drop out of school and he even dodged the draft. Nevertheless, Einstein went back and finished high school. He needed to do this in order to get to the next level in his academic career. And Einstein was eventually accepted into the Swiss Institute of Technology. There, he graduated with a degree in mathematics and natural sciences. Now, we're going to take a look at the family of Albert Einstein. Albert Einstein was first married to physicist Mileva Marek. Mileva was actually considered one of the greatest scientific minds of her time. Together, they had two sons and one daughter. The whereabouts of Einstein's daughter are unknown. One theory is that she died very young of scarlet fever. During his first marriage, he had an affair with Elsa Lowenthal. He was miserable in his first marriage to Maleva. Einstein then divorced Marek. This caused her to have a nervous breakdown. Then he married Elsa, the woman from the affair. However, he wound up divorcing her too. He had many affairs throughout his life. He wasn't a very good husband. Now, on to his important scientific work. As mentioned earlier, he won a Nobel Prize for his work on the photoelectric effect. He predicted that the energy of individual ejected electrons increased linearly with the frequency of light. His best known work is the theory of relativity. A related formula is his E equals mc squared, which stands for energy equals mass times the speed of light squared. Einstein's theory of relativity is used to predict the existence of black holes. Black holes are a region in space and time where no particles can exist inside of it. Let's also remember that Einstein had published over 300 different scientific papers. Much of his work is out there, and it is still being studied to this very day. The next section is his Nazi targeting. The Nazi party had attacked Albert Einstein's work as, quote, Jewish physics. This was all a part of Adolf Hitler's plan to exterminate Jews from Germany and discredit any of their accomplishments. Eventually, Albert Einstein was targeted for death by the Nazi party. Einstein was targeted because of his recognition and brilliance as a scientist. Because of the targeting, Einstein decided to leave Germany and take up study in New Jersey. In an effort to get back at the Nazis, Einstein warned FDR about the Nazi atomic bomb capability. He famously sent a letter to FDR. After the war, Einstein went back to work on his Origin of the Universe. 
he was able to work peacefully in the United States until the time of his death. Now to the last section, the fun section, fun facts. After emigrating to the United States, Albert Einstein became an official citizen of the United States of America. In fact, he loved and supported the United States for the remainder of his life. Einstein was also a member of the NAACP. That stands for the National Association for the Advancement of Colored People. In a rather weird story, Albert Einstein's brain was actually stolen after his death. I guess if you're going to steal someone's brain, why not the greatest of all time? Now, let's end this section with a quote from Albert. If you cannot explain it simply, then you don't understand it well enough. So, that was basically everything you needed to know about the great Albert Einstein. Be sure to check the next biography short on Charles Darwin. Also, make sure to subscribe to this channel, click the bell on the subscribe icon to get notifications, please like and share this video, and most importantly for teachers, check the description link for resources as well.